guys, it's Kay Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to, to episode 11 of Combatants Will Be Dispatched. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, let's see what the boys, well, the girls and one boy. <laughs> oh my god. My band of misfits. Is it weird that I kind of want a side story with him? Yeah, it's a mission. They cute though as well. It makes you wonder, like, especially how last week ended, what those three and how everybody else had to deal with the heroes and such. I really wish we got to see that. I mean, you know, what I would like to possibly see as, like, an OVA. I mean, you know, it could have been nice. Maybe. Who knows? Like, hey, if you want to do a spinoff of this show, yeah, let's go ahead and focus on those three. Because, I mean, like, no offense, like, last week's episode was really good and hilarious and interesting to not really have the focus on Six and his band of girls and shit. I mean, as much as, much as I love my group, my band of misfits, I did like seeing the other three and seeing how they were doing when, you know, Six and Alice and our group is just busy doing other shit or sometimes just chilling out. But it would be nice, I'm just saying. It's just a plus. Like, I'm just saying. Because, oh, wait, hold on, the show is ending. I'll check before I watch back on mine after. Because I think this is on next week. Either next week or the week after. Excuse me. She was hungry. <laughs> uh oh, honey. If you <laughs> you just wish you could have like a camera that like recorded their every moment. <laughs> oh, so <laughs> Rose for snow. What about Grim? Is Grim just laying down? <laughs> yeah, she's just sleeping. I mean, but still, yeah, shouldn't also grin and. Yeah. 
Oh god. A newbie smile. <laughs> she is right, money is everything. Seriously? I mean, hey, the crazy things that people will do for money. Smile again. Oh my god. Okay. No. <clears throat> well you could just like sneak kick some ass sneak again get go home That face. Oh, God. Honey. <laughs> Yeah, 
feels like now we're kind of going like cyberpunk aesthetic now. But very like futuristic, but not like too too cyberpunk. I mean, what well, where they're from, it is completely cyberpunk. Really. Y'all better keep a close eye on Rose, cause she might do some shit. Wait, uh, Snow? Damn, what exactly happened here, though? We don't have time for this! Honestly, this is really a smart idea, but you know, I. Aww. <laughs> oh, that's all. I mean, they're gonna find out eventually. We're 13 minutes into this episode. They gotta find out. <clears throat> Rose. See, that's Rose's conscience coming out like, uh. Mm -hmm. Well, if you say so. <laughs> oh my god <laughs>
But you know, not every human is like that, but I mean, once again, it was a smart plan. <laughs> Probably a lot. Maybe, you know, two, three weeks. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> mm. Oh shit, you killed the kid. Mm. Yes. You got knocked out. Yeah, that's all. Took a really good nap. Yeah. <clears throat> Let me, you know, one of you three could stop this. Did we just become a Gundam, sir? <laughs> Yo.
Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Poor baby. You know, I thought he would just keep that for himself. <laughs> well, for now, you just continue running. Exactly. Ten more minutes for that left. Two. Oh shit! It's already out. God. <sighs> Damn it, Russell. Oh my God. And, and what? Hold on. The show should be ending next week, right? You know what? Let's just go ahead and take the time out right now and go ahead and look this up so that I know. But, I mean, yeah, like, what else can our little combatants, you know, our group of band of misfits, like, what else can y'all do right now? Because, seriously, um, the odds are really more in Russell's favor than y'all's. I mean, y'all, <laughs> y'all are screwed, like, straight up. Let's see, this show, yeah, this show ends next week. Y'all end next week. <laughs> <laughs> Between y'all and Jordan, <laughs> y'all got one episode, one to wrap everything up. I, I don't like. I don't know how the world they're gonna do this and how this could possibly end. And once you know Six and Alice return, you know, explaining their journey to, <laughs> to the girls and be like, yeah, you know, we already explained everything else, but here's all the extra stuff we did as well. But, I mean, it was interesting to see, you know, that Rose, like, was there. I wish we could have gotten to see, like, a little flashback with it and such. But I get it. I, I understand that, you know, we're not going to have time for everything. But it would have been nice to see it. I'm just saying. This is kind of almost like with, um, with Megamine. They're like, especially, like, when we got a movie focused on Megamine and her ish. I'm just saying. It was nice. So kind of do the same thing with Rose. That's all you giving me, huh? Are you fucking... <laughs> that is so... That is so messed up. And I was really excited to see what in the world they were going to put as their final preview. But they just give you that. So honestly, next week's ending could be any freaking way with this show. But still, once again, I mean like... I, once again, I don't really know who is the best girl of this show. I, I think, honestly, in my opinion, it is Snow, because, of course, I like her. She gives me darkness vibes and ish like that. She She's basically if Darkness and Aqua had a baby together, honestly, deadass, because she acts like both of them in a nutshell. But I think, you know, um, essentially, if, they, if this was to be on the same popularity as Kanesuba and such, and let's say it did get a season two and a movie, it might be we focus on Rose because I feel like Rose is a very I, like don't get me wrong like every character in this show is very interesting but if we're looking at the main you know group and such I think it might be Rose and if it's not Rose maybe Grim Hell maybe even Snow because each of those three girls have a very interesting backstory like how now finding out that Snow has never met her parents they could do that as a movie you know, with, with our band of misfits or as an OVA for season two. I'm just saying. Um, they could literally do anything of this. But, like, the biggest thing is, like, for me wondering is the sales of merch and um, 
light novel sales, maybe even manga sales, if they if they're um kind of making this into a manga as well because usually sometimes I do that with some light novels as well I'm not 100% sure I know um the one series I am currently reading has a manga and a light novel at the same time but I mean yeah however else this is gonna end next week I, we all know it's gonna be good and it's gonna be funny six is going to pull something out of his ass like he's always done in order to you know abruptly save everybody and then you know he's gonna go home and woo his woman that's all <laughs> But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Combatants Will Be Dispatched. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Sunday for the final episode. Bye, guys.